first, Way 31's Max Cohan joins us live at John Hunt Park in Huntsville. He spoke with people who got the shot at the clinic today. Max, what did you learn about the process? Well, guys, one thing that everybody seemed to be mentioning was how quick the process was from the time they arrived to the time they actually got the shot. Now, most people told me the entire experience lasted about 30 minutes, but one person actually allowed me to time them from the moment they arrived to the moment they left, and including that 15-minute observation period, their entire visit was just 22 minutes. Yeah, it was super quick and streamlined. Everybody was super professional and helpful. And I just walked right in, and within maybe three minutes, I had my shot. Sparkman High School teacher Erin Wooten was among those who took the opportunity to get vaccinated on the first day of the expanded rollout. She was kind enough to let me time her experience from the moment she walked in the building to the moment she made it back out. All in, from check-in to vaccination to observation and out, it was 22 minutes flat. Hard for even her to believe. I was surprised. I, I thought it wouldn't be as efficient as it was. It was super, super streamlined. But this experience was nothing unique Monday. Many of those who rolled up their sleeves at John Hunt Park experienced the same thing. You can't beat it. With 16 vaccination stations set up inside the JC building, Huntsville Hospital says it's on pace to vaccinate more than 1,500 people each day as long as the vaccine supply is there. A process that lasted about 30 minutes for most is now something they'll recommend others sign up for. Most definitely. It's been, it's been an easy process through here. They're very organized. I got in and got out really quickly. They had me sit down, asked me which arm I wanted, uh, got the needle ready and just popped it in and I was done. Now, this is a pace the hospital says it hopes to keep and cited appointments as a major difference maker. Now, it's important to remember that vaccinations are appointment only at this time, and if you show up without an appointment, you will be turned away. Reporting live at John Hunt Park, Max Cohan, Way 31 News. Thank you, Max. The hospital anticipates it will see the most volume on Friday. That's when they expect to give out nearly 2,000 doses.